Fill in the blanks. 1. Most of the acidic substances are sour in taste. 2. Phenolphthalein is a synthetic type of indicator. 3. The strength of basic substance is represented by OH- ions. 4. pH scale ranges between 0 to 14. 5. Acids and bases neutralize each other to form salt and water. 6. Sodium or potassium salt of higher fatty acids are termed as soaps. 7. In FeSO4, 7H2O represents water of crystallization. 8. 10% NaCl is known as brine. Name the carboxylic acids present in Answer Acid 1. Tamarind Tartaric acid 2. Butter Butyric acid 3. Roots of plant valerum Valeric acid and valerenic acid 4. Lemon Citric acid 5. Milk Lactic acid 6. Orange, citric acid, 7. Red ants, formic acid. Write short notes on 1. Indicators with proper example. Answer. The acidic and basic nature of the compounds can also be indicated by some natural as well as chemical substances. These are known as indicators. Litmus paper or solution is obtained from a plant named lichen. Acids turn blue litmus red, whereas bases turn red litmus blue. There are many natural substances such as rose petals, turmeric, beetroot, etc. that can be used as indicators. They are called natural indicators. Chemical substances such as phenolphthalein, methyl orange, eosin are also indicators. They are synthetic indicators. Mixture of several indicators is known as universal indicator. 2. pH scale with proper diagram. Answer. The pH of any sample can be found out using a universal indicator. pH scale helps in measuring hydrogen ions concentration in a solution. In pH, P stands for potens, meaning strength. The scale reads from 0, most acidic, to 14, most basic. When pH value is between 0 to 7, the solution is acidic. When pH is between 8 to 14, solution is basic. At 7, the solution is neutral. 3. Water of crystallization with proper example. Answer. The water molecules which form part of the structure of a crystal are called water of crystallization. There are fixed number of water molecules present in the crystal structure. Example, CuSO4 5H2O. In this compound, 5H2O represents 5 molecules of water. It is called copper sulfate penhydrate. Answer the following. How do metal carbonates react with acids? Answer. Metal carbonates react with acid to form salt and water and liberate carbon dioxide. NaHCO3 solid plus HCl aqueous gives NaCl aqueous plus CO2 gas plus H2O liquid. 2. Explain in detail about hydronium ion. Answer. Hydrogen ions cannot exist alone. They will always combine with water and form hydronium ion H3O+. Plus. H+, plus plus H2O gives H3O+. Plus. 
base like NaOH when dissolved in H2O undergoes reaction as follows. NaOH solid plus aqueous gives Na plus aqueous plus OH minus aqueous. Acids generate H plus that is hydrogen ions and bases generate OH minus that is hydroxyl ions in aqueous medium. Therefore, the perfect reaction for neutralization can be viewed as acid plus base gives salt plus water. HA plus BOH gives BA plus H2O. A is equal to an ion as Cl minus, Br minus, I minus, NO3 minus, etc. B is equal to cation as Na plus, K plus, Ca plus plus, etc. The H plus ions of acid and OH minus ions of alkali react with each other to form unionized water. 3. State applications of baking soda. Answer. Sodium bicarbonate is extensively used in day-to-day -day life. It is used to prepare light and spongy bread, cakes and dhokla. It also helps to reduce acidity in stomach being alkaline. It is very useful in preparing carbon dioxide gas and is one of the contents of fire extinguishers. How do acids and bases react with each other? What is the name of the process? What product is obtained out of this reaction? Answer. Acids and bases react with each other to form salt and water. Example, HCl plus NaOH gives NaCl plus H2O. This reaction is called neutralization.